The breakout of protests in the opposition strongholds of Nyanza and sections of Nairobi have provoked a heavy security operation. And as the body count from the confrontation rises, the opposition leadership is now condemning the operation. NASA urging supporters to keep calm as it ponders on the next course of action. Please do not compete with these people. They have the means to finish you. Your life is very valuable. We appeal to our, to our supporters and Kenyans at large to stay out of arms way. NASA claims the military disguised as GSU officers is leading the operation against its supporters and has threatened to hold the acting Interior Cabinet Secretary Fred Matiangi personally responsible for the resultant deaths and injuries. We wish to remind Secretary Matiangi and the Police Inspector General uh, Boynet and all his deputies and the responsible police commanders, they are personally responsible for these violations of both Kenyan and the international human rights law. The opposition also displaying what it alleged as evidence of the police using live bullets on the protesters. So they, they bear the mark of the Kenya Defense Forces Ordnance Factory uh, at Eldoret. Uh, we have a factory in Eldoret operated by the Kenya Defense Forces. Uh, so uh, the, the source of this ammunition is, is quite evident. NASA insists the electoral process was flawed. Opposition chief Raila Odinga is running Metkalonzo Mosioka and Moses Wetangula holding a series of meetings a day after the election. But the principals were nowhere to calm the nerves of their supporters. Those who are calling for Raila Odinga to make a statement have a, an ulterior motive. Mm. And, and we can see why they want Raila to make that, that statement. We are, we are not going to be attracted to that invitation. As the country grapples on how to move forward after the polls, the opposition says it will give its next course of action in due course. This is IBC Gazette, the re-election of President Uhuru Kenyatta and William Ruto as President and Deputy President-elect, respectively. A stolen election does not amount to establishment of government as provided in Article 3 of the Constitution. We have the will, the determination, and the means to make sure your vote will count at the end of the day. Mm. We invite them to join us to keep it.